Sorry. I'm happy you guys are here. We have some great stuff going on. Of course, we always have food, entertainment. We have things going on for the kids. Uh, we have great vendors out here. Make sure you guys check out their tables. We're going to be here till about 4 p.m. today, so please enjoy the day. Big shout out to Silver Productions, of course, the city of Brockton. We have just put this on. It's a great day, and please enjoy the day. Let's get going. I'm Lucas Lawson. I'm with Abington Bank. I'm the branch manager at the Abington, Abington location at 6 Harrison Ave in Abington. Um, we're here today just to kind of get out in the community, um, give some stuff away, just uh, have fun with uh, the local community around us. Um, we have uh, 25 branch locations. So come on in, check us out, see what we're about. Um, ask for Lucas at 6 Harrison Ave in Abington. Thank you. So today we're doing photo booth photos. Um, if you don't want to take a photo today, um, you can rent the photo booth and it's a family owned business. Thank you. Hi, my name is Felicita Sepulveda. I represent the Caveri Association of Bratton, 575 North Montello Street. And we do amazing stuff there. We got a lot of things. Uh, we do a lot of help for the community, and like wrap application, housing application. Uh, we got a summer camp in the, in the summertime. We have, uh, we open for small businesses. We helping with Mass Safe. We always working with Mass Safe Revise. It's a beautiful day outside and it's beautiful. And we do this every year. Um, good morning. Uh, great fall day. This is Jean Smith and I'm a Mary Kay independent beauty consultant. And uh, Mary Kay has been, been around for over 60 years. Started by a very outstanding woman who believed in God first, family second, and career third. And it is still run by her family. And today I'm presenting gift ideas for anyone who's who wants to shop early and uh, just stop by and see us. My name is Bill Hogan. We have a, a table here from the Brockton History Group. And these photos are from 1894. And this is before the railroad was elevated. And you can see the railroad is on the ground level here. It's kind of a rare photo. And this photo was taken from City Hall Tower, which we're right next to City Hall Tower. And this was 1894. The City Hall had just opened up maybe 1893 and the railroad was elevated in 1896. So what we have is a panoramic view. We have about eight photos from City Hall Tower. They were the photos themselves, these are prints. The originals are on cloth paper and they go all the way from the north side of Brockton all the way to the south side. So we're gonna have these printed into murals and we're gonna have them displayed somewhere here in Brockton. Could be City Hall, could be the Brockton Library, could be a private entity. And ironically, I also have the photos from the same views from 1920 when the photos, uh, when the railroad was elevated. So it's, it's very historic and they're just, they're fun things. It's great history in Brockton. Good. All right, what we have here is we have a wide assortment of balloon animals. Uh, it's a craft I learned many years ago when I was at Cedarville Junction. You know, I had a lot of time on my hands. So they taught me how to make these things. 
and the kids do love them. Um, I had a little background in making these. I used to blow up blimps for good here. And after that, I went into the balloon making business, and that's the story here at this table. Hi, uh, we are the Greater Brockton Center for Dispute Resolution. We're a nonprofit organization. We're funded in part by the Attorney General, and um, we have mediators. Uh, our office is in uh, the Brockton District Courthouse on the second floor, room 207, and we help people settle their disputes, hopefully before they have to take it to court. Uh, we do neighbor to neighbor. Uh, we'll do a mediation with the, the guy you bought your car from or who's repairing your car. We do um, divorce mediations, juvenile, and we've been focusing on uh, eviction mediations. Yes, uh, um, you can contact us if you uh, are going to court before court and we'll try and help you. Our phone number is 508-897-2868 and it's uh, mediators.gbcdr.org. We're at uh, VFW Parkway, City Hall, Brockton, and this uh, plaque memorial here is in uh, memory of William Henry McGonagall. His nickname was Gunner because he had a strong baseball arm, and he's credited with inventing the, the catcher's mitt in baseball in 1875, and he was playing in a, in a game at Harvard, and his hand was hurting because he didn't have a glove on and he was catching. So there was some bricklayers around. He went over and grabbed one of the bricklayers' gloves, put it on, and, be, and invented the catcher's mitt. And uh, Gunner, I call him Gunner McGill, uh, McGonagall, he owned a, a salon right here, a saloon. And so that's why the memorial is here in VFW Parkway. Whether it's on the exact location, we don't know, but it was in this area. He's also the first manager to ever win consecutive baseball championships in the American League and the National League. And even to this day, as a manager, he has the highest winning percentage of any Dodger manager. So, and he still got fired. So this is down City Hall Plaza, BFW Parkway. And this is uh, during uh, Downtown Fest Brockton. So, William Gunner McGonagall.